All right, what's going on, people? It's a flying modem. Kinda of gamer that likes to play competitively, and I just got off work not too long ago, and about to play some Warframe. Forgot to do a video, and um, you know, talk with y'all for a little bit. So, uh, we're gonna probably gonna do a mission and try to talk through that mission. But the uh, let's say topic of discussion for this video is just where I'm going with the channel, what I want to do with the channel. And stuff like that so uh let's get into it i'm gonna go ahead and select this mission and we're gonna see what we can do I usually have it on public but i think i'll put it on solo usually i would do an alert but i don't have this mission unlocked yet hmm And like in the last mission, I noticed like, well, last video I should say, I noticed I had on a red shirt and this is uh, my red work shirt. <laughs> so if you notice from the last video, the red shirt didn't have a collar. So it's, it's not the same shirt. <laughs> I just wanted to throw that out there. Uh, rescue mission. I don't know if I want to do a rescue mission, man. Let's do a sabotage mission. I'm more in the mood for that. Hopefully I don't fail. That would be kind of embarrassing. I mean, I'm not saying I'm like a Warframe pro or anything like that, but nonetheless, it would be kind of embarrassing. No, I will not help you. If you're wondering why I'm glowing blue, it's because it's extremely cold in the mission. So you gotta like heat up your Warframe suit. This is Banshee. Let me move my water out of the way because I can't see my thing. I love Banshee. Like I said in my previous video, I think it's one of my favorite Warframes because uh, of its unique abilities. And right now I have one of her abilities activated called silence and basically it deafens anything in a certain area. So when I run up on an enemy, you'll see they like start to feel the effects. And I really like that. That's one of her abilities. So with the channel, right? Uh, recently one of the channels I'm subscribed to with my recent tech adventures and stuff like that. Let me see if I have this codex scan. And there's a seed right here too. Wow, that was on Europa. I love this gun. The Stug is like one of my favorite secondaries, yo. I promise you. Like, <laughs> it's so cool. So one of the channels I'm um, subscribed to, I uh, is Jay's Two Cent. And Jay's Two Cent, it's like a tech review. He's into cars and stuff like that. He's into a quite a few different things, but uh, it's sent, it's mainly focused around almost oh, this guy, tech news and tech reviews and you know GPUs and stuff like that. Stuff that I recently have gotten into as of lately. And um, if you haven't known Terry Crews, the guy from the Old Spice commercials, he's done a lot of movies. Uh, some of the movies include White Girls, Longest Yard, um, and The Expendables. In and, uh, and Expendables 3, he was a black guy that, um, you know, got taken out of the pretty much the whole movie. And it was at the very beginning. He had this really cool scene in, the, I think, The Expendables 2, where he has uh, the AA-12, and he's just letting off with it. And ever since then, like, I've, I've fell in love with the AA-12, like, at least in that gun in that movie. The way it sounded and the way it looked and what it did, it was amazing. So, Jay Cruz recently built his own computer. And Jay Cruz sent for certain people will create uh, computers for people. Like, he'll, I'll say create, but build custom computers for people. And um, he's building a custom computer for Jay Cruz. Um... 
and one of these things uh, Terry Crews does is like he has uh, fans from you know different factions of the world that love him from the old Spice commercial for comedic from acting and so on uh, from his football career which I knew very little about I did not know he was a, a football player and one of the things that uh he said in there it's like people say that you're only supposed to have one dream or something like that he was saying and he doesn't believe that he thinks that's a total lie like you don't have to ha just have one dream and um you know you can have a you can do a lot of things so with that being said uh it kind of i need to figure out why this shit is so shiny it kind of like resonated with me because with this channel right it started off with this Call of Duty channel, and I'm like trying to be COD focused and so on. And that was like, well, at least my very first channel was like super COD focused. Like it wasn't anything but COD, and maybe like something else that was like really popular, one video, but really about COD. And then with a flying modem, I uh, try to be more focused around. Here we go. I try to be more focused around just FPS period because I play a lot of games. I play all kinds of games. Now I love my FPS games and that's, I would say that's mainly what I play. But I play games like Civilization and I uh, really like that, that's really fun. And um, I play racing games, Need for Speed was really good. Uh, I play real-time strategy games like Final Fantasy at least I think that's a fine that's a real-time strategy game and um you know platformers side-scrolling platformers and all that like I play a lot of stuff like right now I'm playing Warframe uh, third person whatever but regardless uh, besides playing a lot of games I'm into other things other than video games like as of recently, like I've said, and like everybody, if you've been watching as of lately, know I'm really into technology right now. Like building my own computer, building computers for other people. Uh, just GPU performance, having these like beast ass graphics and so on, like mean a lot to me, yo. And I say it mean a lot to me. That's because I wasn't thinking straight looking at this damn screen not that it means a lot to me but it is very uh man i don't, I don't know how to say it i can't think of how to say it but what I, I i think what i'm trying to say is that it's very important to me it's like a hobby that i really enjoy and there's other things that i enjoy like anime I'm I'm into anime and as personally I'm not one of those people who are like you have to call it anime like anime is cartoon it's Japanese cartoons yo like you know if you hate me for it I understand you know I apologize I don't mean to offend but I personally just feel like it's just cartoons it's Japanese cartoons but I'm into anime I've been watching uh Dragon Ball Super really good I've been watching um Gundams Iron-Blooded Orphans I'm a huge Gundam fan, uh, and I've been really into those things, and I've been really, I've been wanting to do, like, reviews and, like, just videos about those things, because that's what I'm into, right? But, um, I've been hesitant to put that on the channel, amongst other reasons why I'm not putting that on the channel, with, like, uh, recording and quality-wise and stuff like that. One of the people who's supposed to be following me is like all the way on the map. I don't know if y'all can see that, but if you look at the map, you see that there's a blue dot next to me, and it's supposed to be another guy, and he's all the way across the other map. And I'm not about to go back for him. Like, oh well, oh, what well, I'm supposed to destroy is right here. <laughs> so, I'm worried about like what I want to do with the channel, like my identity for the channel. Like most people tell you like with your YouTube channel, focus on one thing and kill it. Like do the absolute best you can with it and so on. And I can't decide what I want to do. Like 
I still love to play COD, and I can't wait to buy Infinite Warfare. Haven't bought it yet, because, you know, I, I pretty much already played it, and I plan on doing a video about that as soon as I can. But I want to have COD background. I want to have COD gameplay in the background to talk about COD. So, that's why I haven't really done COD commentary, because I don't really have a way to record COD commentaries right now, or get gameplay and have it look the way I want it to. So, uh, video games, FPS, anime, technology, um, you know, whatever else I'm into, like going to play test for Activision, uh, vlogs, and just commentaries about random things. And I don't know how to wrap that up into one package and be like, this is the, a flying modem channel, right? So that's uh, something that I'm struggling with when it comes to the channel and structuring it. And it's, I'm not trying to cast a wide net and capture all the audience and viewers that I can. I'm mainly just trying to structure myself and be like, this is what my main focus and this is things that I do on the side. Like I said, I'm into a lot of things. I'm into a lot of hip hop, a lot of rap, a lot of different types of music. Um, I'm you know, very much into cars and so on. I, man, it, it's so much and it's so much that I could bring to the channel. I just don't know how, like I said, to wrap that up, wrap that up into a package. Like, and like I said, this is a flying on the channel. But uh, yeah, that was pretty much all I had to say on that. I'm trying to find my identity, thinking hard about it. And, um, you know, uh, if y'all have some suggestions for me, y'all can leave that in the comment section. I would appreciate that. Uh, as always, like the video if you like the video. And with that being said, I'll catch y'all on the next one. Consider subscribing if you're new. I should have said that before, but y'all get the idea. All right, y'all.